Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Hi kids Mr. Awan is here How are you today? I do hope you are always fine there Very happy to greet you from here Hi No matter what, no matter the current situation is Let's keep studying as like Nelson Mandela said Education is the most powerful weapon Which you can use to change the world But before we start Let's pray first based on our belief. Prayer start. Amen. Okay? Let's get started. Today, we're going to talk about alphabetical order. Alphabetical order is a way to sort or organize a list. It helps a reader to find a name or a title in the list. It is done by following the standard or usual order of letters in an alphabet. Jadi, alphabetical order dalam bahasa Indonesia itu adalah urutan abjad, yaitu cara mengurutkan atau mengatur sebuah daftar. Urutan abjad itu membantu seorang pembaca untuk menemukan nama atau judul di dalam sebuah daftar. Dan urutan abjad sendiri itu e, dilakukan dengan mengikuti Urutan huruf standar di dalam alfabet There are 26 letters in alphabet They are A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, until Z And the total is 26 From the previous pictures, we know that some capital letters look exactly the same as small letters. They are simply bigger. Jadi dari gambar sebelumnya, kita bisa mengetahui bahwa huruf besar terlihat hampir sama persis dengan huruf kecil, tetapi ukurannya sedikit lebih besar. Dan mereka adalah C, K, O, P, S, U, V, W, X, And Z. So there are 10 capital letters look exactly the same as the small letters, but the size is simply bigger. Jadi ada 10 huruf besar yang terlihat sama persis dengan huruf kecil, tetapi uh, ukurannya sedikit lebih besar. And of course there are 16 capital letters look different with small letters. Now, can you answer which letter comes in the middle of alphabet? Bisakah kamu menjawab pertanyaan ini? Manakah huruf yang berada di tengah alphabet? Okay, actually there isn't one letter in the very middle because the alphabet has an even number of letters in it. Sebenarnya tidak ada satu huruf ya. yang berada benar-benar di tengah dikarenakan alfabet itu memiliki jumlah huruf yang genap and it means there are two equal half in the alphabet jadi itu artinya ada dua huruf yang sama berada di tengah alfabet they are M and N so M and N are the letters in the middle of the alphabet. Now, let's play the game. Which letter come first? F or H? Okay, manakah huruf yang duluan? F atau H? Berdasarkan urutan alphabet. And the answer is F. Yes, because F comes before H. F is the sixth order in the alphabetical, while H is the eighth order in the alphabet. Dan jawabannya adalah F, karena F itu hurufnya berada sebelum huruf H. Di dalam alfabet, F itu berada di urutan ke-6, sedangkan H berada di urutan ke-8. Let's continue. What letter is after Y? Huruf apa setelah huruf Y? 
Very good. The answer is Z. And now try to answer this. Yes, the answer is T. Now look at the picture. Which island would be first if they were in alphabetical order? Pulau manakah yang berada di urutan pertama berdasarkan urutan alfabet? Yes, the answer is Borneo. And now try to answer this. Which island would be second if they were in alphabetical order? Yes, the answer is Java. Congratulations for you who answered Java. Okay, that's all for today. Thank you all for taking the time to watch this video. Don't forget to remember this. No matter what, no matter the current situation is, let's keep studying because what we do today is for the better future. Wash your hand, keep the cleanliness, consume the healthy food, and stay at home. See you. Bye-bye.